Good morning. Not much on the log today. Probably the one big thing we have is the weapons violation, and that was a shooting that happened just before 1 a.m. We had uh, actually several people saw this take place, but we had a, a white pickup truck that was driving on Summit Avenue, and when it neared 12th Street, uh, there was a guy that was outside, pulled out a handgun and started firing it, firing the gun at the truck. There were six casings that were found. The truck took off after that. The guy that had fired the gun left. Uh, so we just got kind of vague descriptions on that. Looks like there was a fence that was struck by the bullets, but didn't have any other reports of damage or uh, thankfully no injuries from that. So. Another day, another shooting, it seems like. Yeah, there's been a lot of shootings. Um, you know, some of, some of these we've believe that there's some connection between them but you know something like this where we don't have any victim and we don't have a suspect it's tough to know uh, you know I guess the a working theory would be there would be some kind of connection between the two of them but a lot of these we're just not able to conclusively say that that they're related that they know each other but it's it's one of those things that we're looking at them looking at uh, basically all of the shootings to see if there's any connection between them and when there's shell casings, obviously we have some evidence, so hopefully there may be some, some pieces of evidence, some evidentiary value to those uh, casings. So still working on, on identifying them. What time was that, Sam? It was, it actually was at 1.50 a.m. Today. Today, this morning, yep, at 12th and Summit. And that's kind of it. Um, the aggravated assaults, one of them, was a person that was threatened with a gun. It was sort of a domestic relation, um, or domestic related, I should say, but no injuries from that. That guy was arrested. The other aggravated assault was a uh, domestic. That was a person that was kicked. No serious injuries. Uh, that one, we haven't made an arrest yet. The one assault is a simple assault. The burglary, we had a, a camper that was entered and uh, some items taken from an unlocked garage. The cardiac arrest was an unattended death, nothing suspicious there. The disorderlies, most of those are trespassings. We did have a warrant and then a disorderly phone call. The family disputes, uh, those are mostly protection order violations. We did have a few other uh, reports in there, but nothing serious. The frauds were more reports. The larcenies, a couple of unlocked cars. Uh, a cat was taken from a car. That was a car that was parked, or you know, it was parked at a park. And when they came back, the cat was gone. Um, bicycles, packages, nothing else really of interest. Narcotics, uh, marijuana, and meth, no big quantities. Sex offenses, those are sex offenders that didn't change their address. Nothing big from the simple assaults. The unattended death, nothing suspicious there, and the vandalisms were all cars that were damaged. Concentrated in one area? No, the damage to the cars was all over the place. That's all I have, unless you guys have anything else. Okay, thanks.